Hello, John here with the Columbia River Orienteering Club in Portland, Oregon. Probably the single most important compass skill to have down is putting the magnetic needle aligned up with the orienteering arrow in your compass. A memory jog for this is put red in the shed. What's that all about? Let's find out. Here's our compass, the Sunto M3. Let's have a closer look at these two important parts, the needle and the orienteering arrow. The compass needle is a thin, lightweight, and perfectly balanced magnetized strip of metal. The needle aligns itself with the magnetic field of the earth, with the red end always pointed to magnetic north. Note that with a few exceptions, magnetic north is in a different direction than the north pole. That difference is called magnetic declination. Now keep an eye on the compass needle. Notice as we turn the dial, or rotate the base plate of the compass, the needle floats freely and always continues pointing to magnetic north. Next, let's have a look at the orienteering arrow here. If you use your imagination, it looks like a small, narrow shed with a steep roof. That's where the term shed comes from. So, back to red in the shed. Putting red in the shed simply means moving the shed or orienteering arrow to align it with the red end of the magnetic needle. There's two ways to do this one by turning the dial, and two by rotating the entire compass. Let's look at the dial method first. You use this technique when you want to take a bearing to an object. By holding the base plate steady and turning the compass dial until red lines up on red, we have red in the shed and we're ready to walk on that bearing. Our second technique, red in the shed, is by rotating the entire compass base plate and you usually with it. This technique is used when you want to follow a bearing. Say we want to walk east or 90 degrees. I rotate my compass dial until east or 90 is here at the reed bearing here mark. Then I rotate the entire compass base plate until red is in the shed and the compass is now facing due east or 90 degrees. That's it for putting red in the shed. It's a basic compass skill and hopefully you have it down now.